Hermosa serving, and uh, I hope you like it. Thank you, Max. Oh, I love it! I love it! I love it! When I grow up, I want to look this good. <laughs> years ago I was doing a musical called Dames at Sea and uh, one of the lyrics of a song called Broadway Baby um, included uh, the character's dreams of, of playing the palace and lunch at Sardi's and <laughs> singing at Carnegie Hall. Well I've done two out of three of those and I've only been here a year. Uh. <laughs> um, I, I especially wanted to have you people here today because this entire experience, well, I suppose the moral of this story is never turn down a 10-day workshop. <laughs> <laughs> because that's what Priscilla was. And uh, I just sort of rocked in because I wasn't very interested in the project, but it was a chance to work with the director I hadn't worked with before. And it's been a game changer, a life changer. It's taken me all around the world and it's exposed me to audiences who had never seen me work. And it's allowed me to meet practically everybody in this room at some point, whether it be in Australia or in London or here. And it's been, well, they say don't meet your idols because you'll be disillusioned, but it's quite the opposite has happened. I have been embraced and welcomed, um, and I'm very, very proud to call the people in this room my friends, people whose careers I have watched and tried to emulate and, and respected and uh, I just can't believe my luck. It's, um, I had a dream when I was about nine um, that made me think that there was reincarnation. I dreamt I was walking along the streets of New York in the early 50s with a coffee cup <laughs> and I turned and I walked into a, an empty theatre where there was a rehearsal happening on stage and I handed the coffee cup to the young Julie Wilson and I woke up, I don't know which was more frightening, suddenly realising at the age of 10 that maybe I was going to live two lives in show business, or that I even knew who Julie Wilson was, <laughs> <laughs> and that she was in Broadway musicals in the early 50s. But uh, if it is true that this is my second time around in show business in New York, I really could not think of a more wonderful group of people to be spending this experience with. Thank you all so much for coming today. Thank you, Sardis, for allowing me, Max, and thank you, uh, Richard, for the, the drawing, and uh, bless you all. Thank you so much. For <laughs> 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 Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Right down the middle, guys. Uh, and over here, please. I just saw you. You came into your boyfriend. Oh, yeah. I was like, 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 I was